Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on July 9th, 2022. Welcome to another Surviving Day on the Planet, and welcome to a space weather update as we just had an M2 class solar flare in an Earth facing position. We were looking at that cresting sunspot, top left hand side of our sun. Pretty big sunspot that was turning in, and it just released. An M2 class solar flare. Still waiting for ISPA space prediction spiral to give us a prediction on where this is heading, but it looks like it most likely is heading our way. Lots of activity on our sun right now. Plasma ropes stretching across the southern hemisphere and solar flares popping in the north. And this was a pretty brilliant solar flare. I'll have a close look here at outgoing imagery as there is quite a large plasma blast that took off from the southeast region right here. That was a plasma rope that lifted away and watch, whap. Amazing imagery here from Solar Dynamics Observatory. I want to apologize to all of my followers. I had no service today, phone, internet, or anything. Another close look here at that M-class solar flare. I want to thank you all for tuning in because this is some pretty important information that is shared here with daily events worldwide. Large M-class solar flare in an Earth-facing position, as well a close look here at the plasma filament that ripped away from our sun right there, and that did produce a CME, not in an Earth-facing position, but to say the least, our sun is a little bit more active the last 48 hours, Looking at multi-spectrum, it looks actually pretty hectic with about four now turning in sunspots. And large plasma filament ropes stretching across the southern hemisphere. And that pop with the M-class solar flare. So again, I had no service provided to me today. I'm literally just getting updated now on all of the day's events. I did hear a little bit about political events that were happening, but the big news today was Rogers being down and that affected daily events worldwide. Looking at 193 angstroms there, those are the coronal holes, which are earth facing now. More of a Southern region though. And this is the last 48 hours of our sun. And I apologize for no full update as I wanted to give you guys a quick space weather update here. You can check in on the live stream for earthquakes. Another close look here at the sunspot region that produced the solar flare. This has been interning now for uh, the last 48 hours. So again, thank you all for tuning in. And if you do enjoy these updates, please don't forget to leave a like, possibly share with your friends and family from around the world. Looking at the Space Weather Prediction Center, we were under minor R1 radio blackouts. Solar winds are sitting at 330 kilometers per second. And right there, M-class solar flare, solar X-ray flux now in C range. And geomagnetic activity starting to come down after being jacked up to a KP5 overnight last night. And this was a long duration solar flare looking at the DRAP absorption map. This is the X-ray flux penetrating our magnetic field and affecting our planet and affecting radios. So very strong and long and duration solar flare earth facing today. And that is the DRAP absorption map showing the effects of this solar flare. I'm truly grateful to have you all tuning in today and inviting me into your living rooms, possibly with your friends and family and want to say hello to everyone and much love. Looking at LASCO 3 at the last 40 or 24 hours. And right there on the left hand side, that is the solar blast, M class solar flare. Thanks for watching today. Please 
Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And stay in love. And get your daily due. We'll see you guys for the next update. As well, check out the earthquakes anytime you want. 24-7 live stream is going now. And again, I appreciate you. I'm sorry for the interruptions. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your daily due. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.